Welcome to our Friday morning prayer. Please feel free to pray alongside me or to close your eyes and simply listen. A Friday morning prayer is such a wonderful start to the day. For most people, it is the end of the working week. For others, it is a few more days before they get their break. For most of us, a Friday has a routine of its own. If it is the last day of work, we wake looking forward to the end of the working week. If it is a day at home, spent in the service of others, it is a day like most others. The joyful thing about starting the day with a prayer is that we can thank God for the day ahead and seek his guidance on how he wants us to behave. Let us pray together on this Friday morning. Let us pray. Lord, as I awaken, thoughts crowd my mind. All the things I have to do today, all the things that worried me when I went to sleep. It is a noisy awakening. I want to offer this Friday morning prayer as a way of quieting my mind of all the daily cares and worries and tasks ahead and to take time to focus on you, God, and on your love and your greatness. I find myself quiet in your presence, full of peace and love. This time is precious and set aside for worship, Lord. It is my time to honour you as I awake and thank you for giving me this new day to spend in your presence, Lord. I know that when your son Jesus walked this earth, he showed us by example that early morning prayer and preaching was the way to honour your importance in our lives. I ask you now, Lord, to still my mind of all invading worries and to allow me to focus in the wonder of your existence and depth of your love for all your flock. It is overwhelming to feel that amount of love in your being. When I accept your love into my heart in this my Friday morning prayer, I am aware of how small I am and how insignificant in your presence. Yet I know that you accept me for who I am. You forgive my sins and help me start fresh each day to try and prove my love to you. As I start this Friday, Lord, help me bring a smile to my face and to the face of others as I pass through their lives this day. If it is possible, let me share my love for you, both in my words and deeds. Help me show kindness and support to my fellow man. As I work, help me pay attention to doing a good job and not to be tempted to err into the path of deceit or conceit. Help me be humble in my abilities and help others to do whatever is needed to get a good job done. Through my work, I honour you. Apart from any duties I have to do a good job, guide me in all decisions I make so that I follow your will and your spirit in all the actions I take. Help me to avoid selfish decision-making and to remember to put others first above my own needs. If I am asked to make any sacrifices to my plans, help me to agree to this with a good heart and remember the sacrifices you made through your son. This makes my trials here so small in comparison, so help me to bear them with good grace. If I offended you in any way yesterday by any unchristian action, allow me to make amends today by living true to your will. I am truly grateful for this Friday morning, for the opportunity to embrace life anew, for the opportunity to give you praise and seek your forgiveness for any sins I may have committed. Help me walk a clear and firm path today. If any obstacles are in my way, help me clear them easily and with fortitude. If a chance appears to help someone, 
in any small way, let me seize the chance and give help in a quiet way. Friday is a joyful day, and the sun has risen to bring us light and forgiveness from your heart. Help me to notice all your gifts, the larger gift of life, and the ability to breathe in your air, the small gift of laughter and happiness in another. Help me make someone else's Friday by bringing a smile to their face by a small good deed or word. It might be I remember to thank someone at work who always goes unnoticed or I stop at lunchtime and talk with someone on their own. You have given us the power of words. Help me use mine today in praise of you by actively seeking out tiny moments when I can Use my words to help others quietly. I wake this beautiful day and spend these few minutes actively in your presence, Lord, to remind myself that I am here to do your bidding and that your bidding is that I always do good. Let me find time in my busy day to honour that promise to you, Lord. Keep us safe from harm this day. Amen. If you believe in the word of the Lord, comment Amen. If you would like me to pray for you personally, tell me.